yeah. to me that since this was a giant hit, of course mm-hmm. you would keep hitting that farmland. Mm-hmm. You know, you would go back. But uh, but it is interesting. So the one thing that does make sense to me. So he is a person from Indonesia who came to Holland and had a musical career. And that actually is the least surprising part of this entire thing because there was a deep tradition of what they called Indo rock. And mm-hmm. uh, in fact, the very first Dutch rock and roll record was by an Indo rock band called the Tielman Brothers. And the Tielman Brothers were big in, in Holland, somewhat successful in the rest of Europe, uh, completely unknown in the United States. But in the age of the internet, in the age of YouTube, they have now had this rebirth because they were the best live band you never saw. I mean, there's footage of them on a Dutch TV show from 1960, and you would swear you're watching like a prototype of Jimi Hendrix. Like all the crazy stuff Jimi Hendrix was doing in the end of the 60s, they were doing on a Dutch TV show in like 1960. So there is a history at least of Indonesian people coming to, coming to Holland and having massive music careers. That at least makes some sense. Hey, if you like what you hear, like and subscribe. It really means a lot. And we would love to have you coming back every week. Thank you.